After over 20 years in prison, a convicted felon is seeking release. Bryson Jose was one of three involved in the shooting death of an Army pilot. Manolo Morales has a story. Bryson Jose was sentenced to 25 years in federal prison after pleading guilty to robbery and a firearms charge. In June 1998, Jose and two other men went to the cabins at Waianae Recreation Center in an attempt to rob Army pilot John Latcham, who was staying there with his wife and two kids. Latcham was shot with a rifle and died. His widow spoke out during the court hearings more than 20 years ago. He was a great dad, great husband, and... Um, he didn't deserve this. At the time, Wendy Latcham said the three men deserved to spend the rest of their lives in prison and spoke of the challenges she faced raising her two children without her husband. Because it makes them sad if I'm sad, and so I try not to be sad around them. Jose was released two years ago after serving 23 years. His attorney said Jose had been on supervised release when he violated the conditions by drinking alcohol. So he was sent back to the Honolulu Federal Detention Center a few weeks ago and was in court on Tuesday asking to be released. The hope is that he will continue his mental health treatment, um, which he is very willing to do, uh, and that he will get back into the things that were really serving him well the first two years of his supervised release. The judge pointed out that Jose was doing well for most of the two years that he was out. If he continues to get mental health treatments and is able to stay with his sister, the judge said she is willing to put him back on supervised release. Another hearing is scheduled on September 19th. Manolo Morales, KHON2 News, working for Hawaii.